Dear students, if two scientists from the different part of the world they meet at one place and if they want to exchange their knowledge they can exchange only if they have the common measuring system SI system is a common measuring system worldwide it is the system which is utilized among the scientists today i am going to talk about what exactly the SI system is and what are the units and what are the conventions used in SI system SI system is improved and extended version of MKN's system of units. It is universally used system of measurements. It is worldwide single system helps to understand units without confusion. It helps scientists to understand and communicate the topics of science without confusion. In SI system, there are seven fundamental quantities and two supplementary units. The physical quantities, which do not depend on any other physical quantities for their measurements, are known as fundamental quantities. The units used to measure fundamental quantities called fundamental units. The seven fundamental quantities and two supplementary units under SI system are as follows. The first fundamental quantity under SI system is length whose SI unit is meter and symbol is small m. Length of an object can be measured with the help of measuring tape. The second fundamental quantity is mass whose SI unit is kilogram and symbol is kg. A beam balance is used to measure the mass of an object. The third fundamental quantity is time, SI unit is second and symbol is S. Yes. Time can be measured by using clocks, watches, atomic clocks and stop watches. Atomic clock measures time by using vibrations of atoms. Example, cesium atomic clocks, hydrogen measure atomic clocks. The next fundamental quantity under SI system is temperature whose SI unit is Kelvin and symbol is K. The temperature can be measured with the help of thermometer. The fifth fundamental quantity under SI system is electric current whose SI unit is Ampere and symbol is capital A. Electric current is nothing but rate of flow of electric charge. It is measured with the help of ammeter. SI unit of electric current is Ampere. 1 Ampere equals to flow of 1 coulomb of charge per second. Now, Sixth fundamental quantity is luminous intensity whose SI unit is candela and symbol is CD. Luminous intensity nothing but the quantity of visible light emitted per unit time per unit solid angle. Now the last fundamental quantity 
under SI system is amount of substance whose SI unit is mole and symbol is MOL. The quantity of a substance proportional to number of elementary particles such as atoms, molecules. Symbol of mole is MOL. One mole of carbon-12 atoms equals to 6.023 into 10 raise to 23 particles. Thus, seven fundamental quantities under SI systems are length, mass, time, temperature, electric current, luminous intensity, and amount of substance. Now, apart from seven fundamental quantities, there are two supplementary units used in SI system. These two supplementary units are plane angle whose SI unit is radian, symbol is RAD rad. Second supplementary unit is solid angle, SI unit is terradian and symbol is SR. Now let us have a look important conventions followed while writing SI units. The first convention, full name of units must start with small letters such as, now two examples are given, how to write 10 Newton. In the first example, Newton written capital, another example, Newton written in the small letter. So full name of units must start with small letter, therefore the left one is wrong way of writing and the correct way of writing is 10 Newton. The Newton N must start with small letter. Second convention, symbol for units named after a person must be written in capital letters such as 10 Newtons. Left side is wrong because 10 Newton N is small letter that is not allowed. So 10 Newton with capital letter is allowed if you are writing a single letter. The third one, symbol for units not named, not named after a person. That means name of the person not involved. So not named after a person must be written in small letters. Therefore, left one is wrong and 10 meter is correct. Full stop, punctuation marks not written after the symbol. In left side example, there is a dot after kg that is not allowed. 10 kg is correct. The right side 10 kg, the way it is written, it is correct. Thus we have seen there are the seven fundamental quantities and two supplementary units are used in SI system. How do you find this presentation? Please give me your feedback. And don't forget to like, share and subscribe the video. Meet you again with another video. Till then, wish you good luck. All the best.